Eve, everybody, and Toronto Marlies get set to take on the Cleveland Monsters in the final game of 2019 here at the Coca-Cola Coliseum. And they will face Vinny Bevelainen for the Cleveland Monsters. Well, he's 6'8 and 1 on the year, but a terrific 2.08 goals against and a 920 save percentage. So he is looking to try and stop a two-game losing streak for the Cleveland Monsters. And Kazmir Kaskasuo uh, on the season, 10-3 and 1, 2.41, a 9.16 save percentage, looking to keep things going in the direction that he's got going. He's 5-2 in his last seven games. Well, the Monsters win the opening draw, but the Marlies interested in picking it back up, and they do. Marchman cross ice, and a good stick on it. Out front is... They're hoping to convert with Aberg over on the far side. And Harper gives it back around to Joey Dusak, who lets it go. Patan toward the goal, took a right turn, and getting the glove out. And on top of that one, there was an opening, but Pontus Aberg had drifted just a little bit beyond getting the puck and getting a shot on goal. Think once about that. He went to the backhand and up and over top and down the ice. Good job by Mason Marchman. There's a shot, scores. Paul Bittner comes back just after the power play expired and sends one screaming by Casimir Kaskasuo. Back up for Lilligren. Finding Aberg, works off the hash marks, gets it back to Lilligren. They like to use Brocco here, and he gives it back. Lilligren with a blast and some authority on that one as Patan sends it back to the line. And right back out. And that one is picked up by Lilligren ahead for Agostino out of the box, working back with Gadet. There's the shot, scores! Boom goes to Kenny Mike. One apiece to score as Kenny Agostino sends one in with some clarity. Chipped in and after. Along the near side, Simpson able to stop that one. A little too hot into the corner, and back it comes. Simpson will pick it again on the half boards. Out of the corner and up high. Clendenning likes to shoot from here, and he does. Takes it out front, back off the post. And it is picked up again. They draw closer out front, and just couldn't make that one connect either. Simpson. Shot off the pads, rebound, picked up by Christians Rubens as he sends it back down the ice. But back over, Patan looks out front, nothing there. Back up for Lilligren. Here's Aber. Brocco draws inside of the goal. And boy, that one looked like Brocco had a chance to fire it. Aber hands it over, and Scott sends it down the ice. Out front, and it comes back out to Simpson. Now the Marlies trying to hang in here as uh, the Monsters control the zone. Turning on this one, scores. From distance, Scott. And he puts the Monsters back up 2-1. Chipped by Archibald. The salvo comes back with it, feeding it along and just a little bit too far for Sherwood. On angle, scores. And Kaskasul. Didn't react to that one, and Sherwood puts the Monsters up 3-1. Harper comes back. Here's Agostino, cross ice, Hollowell. Got to take the shot here, got no choice. Little over a minute still to play. Down by two, Patan right into the legs, and now he tried to whack it back toward the goal. There goes Cascasuo out of the hockey game, and it drops back the other way. Aberg has to rush back. Scott scores. The empty netter. And he would have got a pen. I don't know what would have happened there necessarily as Aberg threw his stick. Well, you're right about that. And, you know, sometimes when, you know, it's almost laughable when, you know, you get that many call-ups and, oh, yeah. and your own injuries where it's, 
uh, you know that old thing of hey we got to play it so we might as well win right and uh, everybody bands together and you've got a few guys from the ECHL filling in the blanks but everybody sucks it up and they do a heck of a job they hold Toronto to less than 30 shots on goal in a game which they had six power play opportunities but it's the Cleveland Monsters with the victory 4-1 and uh, a big one for them and a bit of a, uh, a bad shot for the Marlies in this one is they just couldn't really get much going offensively in this hockey game.